everybody and welcome back to my channel. It is Jen with Holmunez Plans and I am back with another memory spread. For this week, I will be planning out the week of November 23rd through November 29th using this beautiful kit from GL Designs Group called Autumn Vibes. This is the week of Thanksgiving, so I hope every one of you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Without any further ado, I'm going to lay down the base of the spread, speed you guys up, and then get back to you with the day today. <music> So starting off, I hope everybody's Thanksgiving was absolutely wonderful and that you guys all got to eat a ton of food and not feel bad about it one bit because I know I did. Um, and I also hope that you guys had a great Black Friday as well <laughs> um, and got to snag some sales from some of your favorite shops. I know that I did. I actually probably did a little bit more than I had originally intended, but my excuse is the fact that I'm supporting small businesses and that helps me sleep at night because my family has a small business and I know how ecstatic and excited we were whenever um, the Black Friday sales started going and people started purchasing from our shop. So if you did participate in Black Friday and you shopped from small businesses, just know you made a family's day. So anyways, uh, I've kind of talked through a little bit of Monday, but I just wanted to chitty chat with you guys and say I hope your holiday was wonderful. So starting off on Monday, as always, I had my Zoom class. So I used one of those beautiful frame boxes from Bloom Paper Studio. That's actually one of the shops that I probably did the most damage at. I'm so excited for all of those stickers to come in. Oh, I cannot wait. I definitely restocked on some of those boxes. Just because like <laughs> I knew from the second I first used one of her boxes in my spread from last week, I was like, I'm going to need like 10 sheets of these because they're so bomb. But anyway, so yeah, I did my Zoom class and I used a box from Bloom Paper Studio, some florals from the Sweet Planner, that shoes from the Glitter Mama, and then the flourish is from Pink Polka Dot Lily. I edited my plan with me and I just layered a laptop from planning like a pro and then that edit plan with me script is from my mom. Then I use um, some of Lay's vine dividers. I just love the way that they pull these fall spreads together. I think it's so pretty. Then I did a huge YouTube binge so I just used a full box from the kit that YouTube TV screen is from the Pretty Pink Co and the YouTube binge is another from my mom. Then I capped off my night and went to the gym with my husband. So I used a third box from the kit, some florals from the Sweet Planner. Those dumbbells are from the Sweet Planner as well. And the gym script is from my mom. Jumping over to Tuesday, the first thing I wanted to mark is that I went and visited my adopted grandpa. So I layered a acorn strung box from the Giving Girl. I'm loving being able to use these fall boxes over a half doily from Honey Inked. That floral piece is from the Sweet Planner, and the little house is from Sweet Tea Plans. Jumping down, I did take a nap on this day, so I used a third box from Panda Bird Designs. That sleep mask is from the Sweet Planner, and the nap time script is from my mom. 
Then I wanted to mark that I had a salad on this day, so I layered a confetti circle from Nettie Designs over top of a little pumpkin deco piece from the Sweet Planner. That little, um, that's actually a grocery bag from the GP Studio, but it has lettuce and all the salad makings in it, so I figured it worked. Then I wanted to mark that I uploaded my plan with me on this day and I talked about it in my last voiceover, but the reason it went up on Tuesday and not Monday as usual is because I had so many technical difficulties and it was just, oh, it made me really sad. So we're going to just move on. Yes, I uploaded my plan with me on that day. <laughs> Jumping over to Wednesday, the first thing I wanted to mark is that I once again had my Zoom class and I marked it the exact same way as I marked it on Monday. I like keeping my like recurring events that happen in my planner um, cohesive. Like if it's the same exact activity, I want to try and mark it pretty much exactly the same because I feel like it pulls the spread together and makes it a little, little bit more well, cohesive. <laughs> um Anyways, then I wanted to mark that I cleaned my kitchen. So to mark that, I use a third box from the kit. That little clean kitchen icon is from the Fox and Pip. And yeah. <laughs> Jumping down, I wanted to mark that I had a Disney Plus binge. I've been watching so much Recess. <laughs> I don't know if you guys remember that show. I am obsessed with it. Um, it used to come on on Saturday mornings when I was little. And then I remember when the series came out like in full. Um, I, it was just, ah, it made me so happy. And I just remember as a kid wishing that I could like have a experience like that because I was homeschooled. So I didn't go to school or whatever. I'm like living vicariously through these kids like, oh man, is that what recess is really like? And of course, obviously I grew up and I learned, no, that's not what recess was really like for public school kids, but a girl could dream, right? Right. <laughs> um, then to cap off the night, I went to the gym with my husband and I just used a half box, some floral from the sweet, from the sweet planner, um, a piece of floral from honey inked. And then the treadmill is from sweet tea plans. Jumping over to Thursday, the big old day, I first marked happy birthday because it was my mom's birthday. Um, her birthday is the 26th of November, and every so often it lands on Thanksgiving. So it landed on Thanksgiving this year. So to mark that, I use one of those gorgeous notch boxes from Miss M. Yao, the another piece of floral deco from the Sweet Planner. That balloon is from the Glitter Mama, and that Flourish is another one from Pink Polka Dot Lily. Then to start off our Thanksgiving feast, we went to my husband's grandparents and had a small portion of what his grandmother made. Um, and then I marked Happy Thanksgiving in my full box and I used that. Um, I used pieces of floral from the Sweet Planner, two um, half doilies from Honey Inked, and then the Happy Thanksgiving uh, script is from Rose Colored Days, and I just fell in love with the way that this looked. I was really happy with it. I think it's my favorite piece of layering that I did throughout this entire spread. Like, oh, I just love looking at it. Uh, we then went to my mom and dad's house where we partook in my mom's spread, and I marked that the exact same way. Um, I used star clusters from Honey Inked, and that cutlery is from Rose and Tea Shop. Then to cap off the night, I just marked food coma because, you know, we all fall asleep after we have Thanksgiving. So to mark that, I use another third box from Panda Bird Design and then a divider from Honey Inked. Jumping over to Friday, I had to mark Black Friday. And to mark that, I used a small frame box from Sweet Bella XOXO, another piece of floral from the Sweet Planner, and a flourish from the Glitter Mama. Then, of course, I marked that I bought stickers. So to mark that, I use a label from the kit. Those sticker sheets are from Cross by Towie. The buy stickers script is from GL Designs Group. Then I marked that I went to the gym to work off some of those calories from Thanksgiving. <laughs> so to mark that, I use another piece of deco from the Sweet Planner, a doily dot from Cross by Towie, and a sports bra icon from My Newest Addiction. And then I marked that we had dinner, or no, we had second Thanksgiving dinner over at my sister's house. So we had two Thanksgivings the day before, and then my sister made second Thanksgiving because her husband is a pilot and he wasn't there on Thanksgiving. So that's what we did. And then to cap off the night, I watched some Christmas movies on Disney+. Plus. Jumping over to Saturday, the first thing I wanted to mark is that I cleaned my house. And to mark that, I used a half box from the kit with a piece of floral deco from the Sweet Planner. And to make it fit a little bit better in the column, I uh, 
cut the box a little bit and then layered it to make it look like it's a teeny bit shorter than an actual uh, half box. Um, and then I used an icon from Crafts by Towie in the corner. I marked going to the gym the same way with a piece of floral deco and a confetti circle and that sports bar icon is from the Pretty Pink Co. Then I wanted to mark that I went over to my parents' house and decorated for Christmas. My absolute favorite thing to do this time of the year. So I don't have any of my decorating for Christmas stickers yet. They're on their way. I ordered some during Black Friday. So I just used some of those hanging bows from Sadie's stickers. I figured that kind of worked. Then I wanted to mark that we had a game night birthday for two of our friends. So to mark that, I used a half box or a third box from the Happy Planner. And then a piece of floral deco. And the game night sticker is from Cross by Towie. Jumping over to Sunday, I wanted to mark that I finally got my hands, well, I didn't get my hands on it yet, but I was able to purchase a sticker kit planner. I'm so excited. I don't think my fingers have ever flown so fast to try and order something. I managed to snag one though. Then I wanted to mark that me and my husband went over to his grandparents' house to visit them and also to try and wrap their pipes because it's supposed to freeze tonight. Hallelujah, it's finally getting cold in Texas. Then I wanted to mark that I made some bomb diggity mac and cheese. It was really, really good. So to mark that, I used another one of those boxes from Bloom Paper Studio, another piece of floral deco. That flourish is again from the Glitter Mama. The icon is from Crafts by Towie. Then I wanted to mark that I edited this plan with me. I used another notch box from Miss and Meow. The edit plan with me script is from my mom. Then to cap off the night, I watched the Santa Claus 2. And I used a label from the kit. That TV is from the Glitter Mama. And then the Disney Plus script is from Peachy Plans. These are the leftovers that I have from this kit, along with a Viv Wiggle. I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching. Once again, I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. If you're new here, hi, I'm Jen. I do planner things. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you later.